Hello everybody, I'm Evil Rabbit. We are back here in the next level racing chassis. Finally, everything moved into the new place in the new streaming recording studio, everything like that. We're getting everything fully set up, but today we do have the Mazda R9, the CS wheel in the next level racing chassis, and we're back doing a shakedown with a new monitor, ultra wide monitor and everything like that. So we're here on Fujimi Kaido in a GR86 to go full set. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media, all the found description box below. Let's get to it. So it's definitely exciting to be back here on the chassis in the rig. Um, got everything pretty much moved in. And we're going to be going full send. Like I said, we're on a new monitor. So we're at 144 hertz instead of 165. So something that I'm going to have to get used to. Still trying to utilize and figure out where all the recording cameras and everything going right now we just got this one set to the side so we're gonna go full send the so full send here on the mountains oh that turned a little bit longer than i thought i don't think i've actually driven this car so gonna get used to the grip feel of it now the monitor change oh a little bit wonky <laughs> the monitor change is not that big of a change dropping from 165 to 144 um, and so it's not that critical of a change, but it is still something slightly different. The refresh rate being 144 instead of 165 will make something slightly different in the aspect of how quickly I can see stuff. Not very much, but you never notice it when you go up in monitors. But when you go down from like a higher, you know, hertz rate to a lower one, you do notice a bit of a difference. Don't want to go in that wall. So, shaking down a car on the rig in the new location that I've never driven. But it's great to be back here. Oh boy, that was a very big unto. This car is super gripped up. This car is really grippy. I believe it's on BDC tires. This thing is so gripped up. It's way grippier than my ESCA car. Oh, but of course, you never notice how big of difference things make. We're all over the place today. How big difference is when you move into a new location, like with the wall being like right next to me here now and things like that you don't realize how much of a difference it actually makes in what you're seeing and how your rig actually feels like just something as simple as changing locations changing monitors you know you get a different feel when you're sitting in the chassis because of different peripherals around you and this car is super gripped up Yep, we're in the wall. Ow. We got to get all the recording parameters and everything dialed, some settings. Because we are on an ultra-wide monitor now, so... Need to figure out... Uh, I'm just making a mockery of this course right now. We need to figure out all the recording parameters and how I want to set all of the uh, settings and everything. This car is super gripped. I don't know how I feel about the physics or the grippiness of this car right now. See that did that weird understeer thing? That's weird. It's almost like this car is just too gripped up in the front. And I am just running this out of the box, so. Oh boy. Get a little bit of frame rate loss there, I'm noticing, down a little bit in frame rate. So we do need to 
adjust some of our uh, some of our settings for the new monitor because we are running to extremely high. That's a lockup. <laughs> so things that we got to get dialed out, but we'll be getting dialed out all this week and everything like that. So we're gonna be doing full videos this week for you guys getting everything situated in the new rig in the new location because the way I have it recording right now you're only seeing basically the majority of the center section I see it way more on the screen than you do uh, because of the ultra wide um, if I gave you guys the full full view of the monitor you guys would see some black lines around the upper and lower section of the recording so these are things that I need to see if oh we're gonna die I knew that I knew that turn as soon as I hit it so a quick video for you guys here today let you know we are back on the rig everything is set up so we're gonna be doing all kinds of things we're gonna be doing stuff on the desk as well on the actual you know things with modeling and stuff like that because now I have a good location to actually sit at a desk and do modeling so overall this car was something else and uh, I don't know if it's just the physics that were messing with me or whatnot but it was definitely very different or the new setup and everything that I have going on but we're gonna be getting that dialed in this week so make sure you guys follow me on all social media all that you found in the description box below and as always I like thank you guys for coming back and watching I'm Evil Rabbit I'll see you guys on the track <laughs>